12 Dane Dane how you doing 12 uh, 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 it's the 8th of August 2019 Cincinnati how you say what time 822 so we're exactly 20 minutes before sun's set and we've got so many light sources coming up all right the huge yellow one is over in the north Ooh, there was plasma did you see that all right the giant orange one is over in the north but there's two different kind of red down here so okay all right so i worked so hard today out in the heat i mean the simulator is just nah. <laughs> all right so over in over in west northwest there's a red glow <laughs> dead in, i mean due west <laughs> is where that there begins but then it goes oh <laughs> there's a red glow up and now and there was <laughs> okay so I was mentioning to 12 how sore we all feel right now and how weird some of the way. We're nano filled? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, well guess what? Today <laughs> before I got off work. I heard the Cardinals saying, Okay, I've been studying big time why that why I think they're either saying Cristo. Um uh, Callisto which is somebody from the X-Men, someone who like Storm had to kill or almost killed, but then they became great friends and they survived the, I think they were called the Marauders or, look at that red thing. Um, well today, when I was leaving work, I was walking away from work and they said, Crystal, Crystal. Now, that ties in deeply with something that I've been speaking to a few people about on YouTube. Because for the last two days, I've felt my fingertips absolutely feeling like there were quartz crystals in them that were, that were, uh, you from inside the finger? huh? Like inside? Yeah. And, and my toes as well. My toes for sure. And my cheeks, my cheekbones, and sometimes my eyelid. Do you think the sun's been doing that to us the last few days, big time? Yes. Have you felt that? Yeah. That's, oh my gosh. Look at this. There's a red object there. A deeper red object down. Did you get that plasma? Yeah, yeah. Cool. It was a bit to the left of the screen, but I, I did. Cool. And it's not coincidence, dude. Nothing of this is coincidence. Oh where my. Went again. Wait, where? The plasma. Where? By in between the towers. I'm sure I got it on film. I wasn't looking at it, but the the camera's okay. running, man. This is so neat. It's so fun to be doing this. You know, today at one point, <laughs> today at one point, okay, no, not at one point, seven, be specific. I had finished loading up my truck and I was on my way to my first job. I'd stopped and I'd gotten ice because I knew that out in the simulator, and believe me folks, it's 20 degrees hotter than what they say the heat index is, and the heat index is 10 degrees hotter than what they say the normal temperature is. Oh my gosh. So I'm on my way to my first job. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. My ears are stuffed. My head is so packed. I, I, I just couldn't sense. Couldn't think. You know when you used to be able to yawn? Yawn about life? No, you'd be able to yawn and your ears would pop. Notice how now your ears just stay stuffed. Your head stays stuffed. So I prayed. I straight up did. I prayed, boy. And, and I did not just pray in the name of Yeshua. Though I did start the prayer, but I asked Lord Enki, please, please, my head is done, please, please. And you know, within 60 seconds, I saw an axe on the astral plane. And it told me, to, it, they said yawn. And I yawned, and I was like, this ain't gonna work. And my left ear cleared up. They said yawn again. And I saw an axe on the right side of the astral plane. And it didn't quite clear up. But boy, for the rest of the day, I got remote viewed. Okay, and I gotta say this. I had to adjust the light a little bit. Look at that red ball. And what was that plasma right there? When I said ball, the plasma popped. <laughs> I got remote viewed because I found myself agitated by maybe my shoestrings coming loose. Uh, the top of my water cap not being quite screwed on right and when it 
fell over, it spilled <laughs> uh, uh, half a gram of water on, the, you know what I'm saying? Something told me, do you not see that you can absolutely look darkly through the other side, past every little thing, and find joy in it. And I was like, I'm gonna do that today. So I just zoomed in. You know, I, I have to do that now. I can't I can't do like I used to be able to do on the, what it, yeah, okay, yeah, I will. Dang, Dean is right. 8.28 p.m. I wonder if that's the real sun. <laughs> Okay, so anyhow, you know, I, I realized <laughs> we absolutely are in control of everything right now in terms of our emotions and what we emote, what we give off, what we receive. <laughs> no, it's not the sim. It's not the simulator. Trust me, it's not. No, it's about sunset though. So, 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 so I realized that something was was reaching through lightly from the other side of the mirror to us. And I did begin finding the most beautiful feathers. It was absolutely stunning. And then I was texted by someone who said that for the next four days, there's an alignment of like Earth and quite a few other celestial objects and that something is gonna take negativity and nastiness from us. Ho hold on, just just let me finish this, man. So, wait, wait which one? Which ball? The, the yeah, I'm filming it, bruh. No, well, uh, just. I'm seeing two different colors. <laughs> in the okay, I have to trust Dean. Dang, I do have to listen to Dean. Boy, when Dean speaks, <laughs> clench up your cheeks. <laughs> You know, and I realized that 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 we needn't we needn't even acknowledge negative thoughts in our minds. That's what I'm trying to say. You know, look at this. Okay, so so you got you got the the red sun, and then you got the giant glow of fun. <laughs> the big red, the big red, uh, uh. <laughs> I mean, I just don't know. <laughs> you know, so. <laughs> so I mean again, you know, when I realized that today that that we have a choice to either let ourselves be aggravated, let the 5G and the cell phone towers run kind of, you know, the emoting of what we do or we can like look darkly through the other side, darkly through the mirror. And it was such a fun day afterwards. I found the Bang in this bluebird feather. Big old blue jay feather. And why? Because I was staying on the path. So, yet again, we have the Sam Hoffman giant, giant shapes in this. I mean, I don't even know what to call them. I mean, there's something huge right there. All right? Something huge and blue. Right, Sean? Giant circular. And then there's like a dark puke blob. The Joker blobs are what I like to call them. They're always puke green and purple look at that look at this i mean which one's the sun the huge red one over to left or 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 that one or or <laughs> or the reflection off of my crystal diaper in the entire north <laughs> 835 i mean i'm going normal light right now because that's the best way to see the giant strange not at all center giant red glow behind that thing all right i brought the brightness down a little bit look at that you got three layers of color off center three suns oh what fun that is a trip now you got the three glow, the faux 18 layers of glow, <laughs> but look over to the left of it. I mean, again, that's just, that's just a new dentist. Shut up, you big old crickety. Did you hear that son of a? Yeah, that sounded like that little just got taken out of the air. <laughs>
I'll be back, y'all. It's the Captain 12 and Dean. Bye.